mean? Grandma puts a ladder in front of the door? I don't see paranoid. Put this up. I will. everyone welcome back to another estrogen release video i am asia and today i decided to do a weekend in my life so this isn't a weekend in a life video once the weekend started i realized that my schedule wasn't going to permit me to vlog the way i wanted to so i just made the video about my granddaddy i just wanted to come in and let you guys know that so it's no confusion on what this video is about so Let's get back to it. So let's get this thing started. As you guys can see, I got my mask on because I'm over my grandparents' house. Say hi, granddaddy. Hi, how you doing? But, um, uh, oh, you want to say hi? Happy, I mean, good morning to grandma. Good morning, everybody. I'm blessed because she is here taking care of us. Got back here. He is getting his COVID juice today, and I believe he's excited. No, not really. You're not ex Just another day. <laughs> Just another day. <laughs> but yeah, so I'm trying to keep my distance, but also, you know, stay masked up because even though he's getting his COVID juice, still don't want any mishaps. Ain't that right? Right. I got Jesus juice. I got Jesus juice. So that keeps me safe. Amen. I'm basically sitting over uh, my grandparents' house because he's getting picked up and I want to sit with my grandma until he gets back. And um, yeah, that's what we're doing. Frye starting off rice a little early, but you gotta do what you gotta do. And uh, yeah, and, yeah, yeah. <sighs> That's what it was all watery and butter. Oh, and yeah, stuff. I don't like that either. I'm good, I'm full now. It's just, it wasn't good. <laughs> I know what you mean. Yeah. My taste buds are really heightened. And, and anything that ain't taste right, I don't like. Alfred, did you put hazelnut in here? No, yeah, you said put this the only cream you got over here. One? I don't taste none of it. So when my granddaddy came back, I was a little nervous because I wasn't sure if he was gonna be, you know, in pain. I didn't know if he was gonna be feeling his best, but homeboy came in you know, off the rip of requests. Can I get some popcorn? Fix me some coffee, something else. I was like, whoa, did you get a shot or not? But he came in, came back home, full effect. That was that clip. Um, I wanted to kind of interview him, but it was too loud during that time. So this is kind of later. And I was like, you know what, Granny, let me hurry up and get you on camera so we can answer these questions. And that's what I did. So back to the video. Aren't you gonna get Gertie in this, Gert? She over there chilling. Now the granddaddy's back and the house is quiet now. I can actually ask him the questions that I wanted to ask them because I want to know about the experience of the vaccine. I'm quite sure it's just regular schmegular, but I just want to see his perspective on it. So 
let's get into it. Okay, Granddaddy. So, did you have to sign like a waiver or anything? No, I haven't signed nothing. They read something to me. I forgot what it read. What? It was okay. I did more sitting than anything. Did you feel lightheaded or did you feel nauseous after you were nope, poked? Nope. Thing. All I felt is the prick in my arm. Was it my quick? My left arm is just just like a needle when they give you a, a vi any shot for a virus, a vaccination. The whole thing takes about two seconds. Those fish sticks must be really good, Granddad. Cause you yeah, they are. Smacking on them jumps. They only take about two seconds and then they say you feel sore. Not today, but tomorrow. So like now, I don't feel anything. That's we, good. So we had to get in this long line, got up there to the lady, and they checked us in, and then we got in another line. <laughs> but the lady came right out and said, come on, I'll take you right now. I said, good, oh, thank you, thank you. She said, well, what arm you want? I said, my left arm. So I rolled up, and I asked her, what, what am I taking? She said, you're taking the... Pfizer uh, uh, serum. Uh, oh, they did ask us some questions like, did I have, was I around anybody with the with the coronavirus? Did I have any symptoms of the coronavirus? Then after, the, after, after I got my shot, they sent me out in the hallway with some other people, and I had to sit there supposedly for 15 minutes mm. to make sure I didn't have what they call after effects. You know, because some people have after effects. What know? does the after uh, after effects include? Allergies. Some people would have, you know, uh, I don't know, vomiting or something. Not death, right? No, not death. Just just an allergic reaction. But I didn't have any. I just sat there. Nobody there had any reactions. And, but Alpha and I, we were sitting there for a long time, and the lady forgot about us. Mm. When we finally, she said, oh, I'm sorry, I forgot y'all, forgot about y'all. Yeah, y'all can go. I thought maybe she was leaving me there longer because I was old, you know. And she, <laughs> and she wanted to make sure I was okay. She said, well, we'll see you when you get your second shot. Then the first shot of Pfizer gives you about 65% uh, uh, um, uh, uh, immunity. Immunity, yeah. And when you get your second shot, after one week of your second shot, you get 95% immunity. Then after one week later, I should be completely immune. For how long? Is this like a yearly thing? Yeah, it's supposed to be for a long time. They don't, that's the thing, they don't know. They haven't had any tests or Oh, how that's long. true. So overall, it was a good experience? Yeah, mm-hmm. It wasn't really surprising. There was no more experience then I went in for a flu shot. That's good. That's all. It was just like a flu shot. Now if you wake up tomorrow with a tail, what you gonna do? What do you mean with a tail? Like if you grow a tail. Ooh, I'm gonna I'm be upset. We're gonna make money off that tail, aren't we, Granddaddy? No, no. We're gonna make money off that tail, aren't no, we, Grandma? No, no. But I'm glad it was a good experience. I was, uh, I prayed this morning because I was a little nervous. Uh, no, everybody on the radio and, and on the TV Everybody said it was nothing to it. They said, people make a lot out of it. They said, I mean, you know, it was nothing to it. Or there's nothing to it. Either you want it or you don't want it. That's good information, now, Granddaddy. That's for me now. I can't say for everybody. Yeah, yeah. So I'm glad to be an experiment for the family. Experiment you. <laughs> Since I'm the patriot. Don't, don't make it seem like we, <laughs> we, we took yeah, a vote. So I'm the first runner. So y'all can watch me and see how I act, see? Mm -hmm. If I get funny if one of y'all, then y'all know what to do. If you start acting crazy, Granddaddy. Yeah, and besides, I want my wife to take it real quick. I want her to get it. Your now, son registered today, so. Oh, he got him registered, huh? Yeah. Well, good. So, there you have it. Basically, my Granddaddy came home and he was chilling for pretty much the rest of the time that I was there. Gave him a call a couple of days later just to see how he was doing and he was like i feel fine no issues so all in all i'm pretty you know thankful that he's good to go um and will be good to go um, once he gets his second shot just wanted to come on here and let you guys know 
this video is not to promote the vaccine or persuade you to take the vaccine. It's not the energy I'm trying to put behind this video. I just personally feel like there's so much negativity going on about the pandemic and the vaccine and the importance of vaccines, just so much negativity. I just wanted to shed some light on the positive side of vaccines. Um, I, thought, I mean, my grandfather was pretty, you know, satisfied with his experience. And he's also looking forward to, you know, being immune to COVID. So all in all, I'm pretty happy that he's happy. And so, yeah, I just want to come on here and say that. So that being said, what are your thoughts on the pandemic, the vaccine? Are you apprehensive about taking it? Are you nervous to get it? What's, what's your thoughts? I want to hear you. So please leave a comment. Please leave a comment. Thank you for watching. If you're watching, please like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next video. Peace. Bye. They're taking a pure electric signal and sculpting it into something of beauty.